Before we get into this video, please subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification button and please like this video as well. Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you guys have all seen by the title of today's video, today I will be doing like kind of like a bit of a Q&A um, kind of video because I haven't really filmed one of these in a while and everyone always asks me to film these videos. I don't know why because I don't feel like I'm an interesting person. Everyone always wants to find out more information about me from these type of videos so that is why I'm filming a Q&A today for you guys. I have got a list of questions on my phone Um, I have asked you guys give me some questions and I did also find some on Google because sometimes when I ask some questions on YouTube I don't always get a lot so that's why I've kind of added some from Google as well Um, so I do have quite a few on here so without further ado let's go on with the video right so the first question is how is YouTube going for you at the minute honestly YouTube at the minute is going great I honestly enjoy uploading YouTube videos and making you guys smile and everything like that and oh my god it's just so fun and I try to upload a couple of times to three times a week because obviously at the minute I'm going to college I do go to college two days a week and then I do have a call on the morning so and obviously I work at the weekend so I try to work my YouTube around work college and Scott Um, I know he does help me with YouTube and honestly I'm super grateful um, that he loves YouTube that he loves YouTube and that he loves helping me out with the videos and stuff but yeah honestly YouTube at the minute I am enjoying it, I'm gaining a lot of the minute as well and honestly it's making me super happy. Um, next question is, do you find it hard to film with stutter? Yes I do, um, I, I usually find it hard if I'm under pressure or if I'm, if I'm feeling stressed about something like say I've been working and it's been really stressful or I don't know, if I'm ever feeling anxious about something or if if I ever feel under pressure when filming a video, sometimes I do find it hard to talk. Um, so I do do a lot of breathing activities to kind of help me like slow down and try to talk normally. And also, I think tomorrow, um, it'll be Thursday of the 22nd of October. It is actually Stutter Awareness Day. So you could all go and show your support. It'd be really nice and helpful. Um, but yeah, but like, I do find it quite hard to talk at times with my stutter, like it does annoy me a lot and it does put me down sometimes, but you know, I'm dealing with it. My next question is, would you ever consider moving away to do YouTube full time? Um, in the future, maybe if I had more subscribers and I needed to move away, then I maybe would. However, I would hate to leave my family um, like behind and if I moved away to London, I will be like so scared as it is a busy like s city and it just like be a bit like whoa. I would only move away if it was like for a job or something but you never know I might be moving away to London or somewhere in a couple of years time who knows but maybe I don't know. Any tips on how to save money? Ooh, um, this is quite a hard one but um, my tip is for you to save um, your money is to kind of like save like half your wages um say you earn 150 pounds or something um save half of the wages or i'll try to calculate how much you need each week and then save um the leftover money however at the minute i have found it harder um to save as i have i have been ordering online a little bit um so my savings has been going down a tiny bit but yeah um it is important to save your money and um, like in case you ever need it for anything the next question is what have you asked for your birthday so if you don't know i will be turning 19 on the 31st of october i can't believe i'm actually turning 19 years old i felt as if my 18th was wasted from covid but you know i'll be 19 in 10 days i think where yeah, because I'm born the 31st of October, it's the 21st of October when I'm filming this. Oh my god, 10 days. But yeah, for my birthday, I haven't really asked for a lot because I got my laptop as a birthday and a Christmas present. Um, in case you don't know, I've got the MacBook Air in gold and it's the best laptop I've ever had. So part of my birthday present is the MacBook Air, which is like the main birthday present. But um, all of other people have kind of asked for a new set of makeup brushes. I've asked for 
eyelashes because I'm obsessed with eyelashes. I've also asked for hair curlers and is there anything else I've asked for? I think I've, t I think I've asked for like the usual items really, like cloves, like chocolate, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, but um, the main things on my list are makeup brushes because a lot of my makeup brushes are kind of like broken and I'm in need of them and hair curlers because the hair curlers I've got are like really old so I just want to get a new pair but I did ask for the, the, the Molly May Wave Curler I think, the Beauty Works one and it looks so good and it's like pink and white and it's so pretty so hopefully I get that but if not I'll be able to buy it myself because I love like spending my money <laughs> but yeah so I haven't really asked for much for my birthday because it isn't really anything I needed to be honest the next question is do you think you and Scott will be together for a while I'm hoping so Um, I have been with him for three and a half months and you know it's been great I've enjoyed every minute of it so I'm hoping I will be I'm hoping I will be with him for a good while hopefully forever if we do work out, who knows, he is a lovely person and he is very special to me and I love him. But yeah, um, I'm hoping I will be with him for a very long time, fingers crossed. The next question is, do you get a lot of hate from purchasing fake designer? Yes. Like, every time I upload a Volvo video, the amount of comments you get from fake accounts and just random people is ridiculous like um i understand that fake designer items are usually made by people who work in factories who are underpaid however i do tend to buy from sellers who who charge more for the fake designer items and i usually buy them by people who are from the uk as well so that it's more what's the word it's a lot more friendly economically friendly or something like that I think um but yeah I do get a lot of hate I just ignore it because it's my own money and it isn't as if I bought a real design item and they've killed an animal to make it do you know what I mean um I do buy a lot of fake designer items because the real designers kill animals to make them into handbags which I think is disgusting so yes that's the reason why I do buy a lot of fake designer because I kind of am addicted to Volvo as well um next question is have you started your Christmas shopping yes I actually started on Monday or Tuesday and I've never been as stressed out in my whole entire life so obviously I have a boyfriend for Christmas this year I have not actually bought for a boy for Christmas and I don't have any brothers so I do not have a clue of what to buy Scott for Christmas he made me a list but most of the things on this list are sold out everywhere and there are a pair of shoes and his feet are size 12 and those pair of shoes have been sold out in his size because he's got size 12 feet he literally is a clown literally they've been sold out everywhere and been so stressful but yeah um. I have started, I think I've only bought one item so far and I will be going shopping today actually for Christmas presents um, I want to be organised and I may just start on it earlier in case we do go into lockdown and all the shops close because and, and also a lot of the things online at the minute have been sold out I think because everyone has been making a start on Christmas shopping so um, I want to be a bit more organised and get everything before in case anything happens to be honest but yeah um, I've tried to save for Christmas and it is a very expensive time of year, definitely. Next question is, will you ever bring your own merch out? Yes, um, at the minute I will obviously because I only have a small following on YouTube. However, in the future, if you guys ever like merch, it is something I would happily do. Um, well, actually, you know what I want to do? I want to bring out my own brand of like eyelashes because if you know me, you know I love my falsies. I love them so much and a lot of people on Instagram have been making their own like eyelash brands and companies and honestly it is so cool so um, maybe we bring out my own eyelashes, clothing range maybe, um, makeup range as well oh my god imagine a homeware range or like cleaning range oh my god I'm a bit excited, plenty tell but yeah 
hopefully in the future I could work with like a company I could have my own makeup range imagine that Alice Holmes makeup or like I don't know um, Morphe times Alice Holmes oh my god imagine imagine oh Morphe I'd honestly love Morphe oh my god I'm literally so obsessed with makeup if you don't know <laughs> right next question is and this is actually my final question is any tips on starting a YouTube channel honestly my tip is just go for it just ignore what anyone says to you if you're doing it for you it is your channel your life I recommend that you try to upload at least every week if not twice a week do not need like a fancy camera at first I got a camera after two years off of my channel and it is cool to have a camera however you can easily film on your phone I vlog on my phone a lot and it's great but yeah um, um, you just need to be yourself ignore anyone who tells you otherwise does that make any sense? I don't know if it does but I'm not the best person to give advice to people um, but yeah I hope that kind of helps you guys but anyway here is the end of my like Q&A kind of video I really hope that you guys have enjoyed if you have you know what to do make sure to leave a thumbs up comment down below and please subscribe to my channel we are super close to my goal of 4,000 subscribers I want to I want to try and hit it by my birthday which is in 10 days so I think to reach 4k now I think we need to get 440 so please subscribe because it is free it, it would honestly make my birthday if I could hit 4k I still have faith I still believe we're able to hit it so please subscribe and I will see you all in my next video bye everybody